Here's your 41 Action News update. I'm Dia Wall with 41 Action News. Here are your headlines. A massive delay for anyone who uses I-35 in Johnson County to get home from work. Crews closed parts of I-35 near 69 Highway to clean up and investigate a deadly wreck. It all happened around 1030 this morning. Crews say it started when a semi pulled off onto the left shoulder after losing a left tire. Well, a van hit the trailer and it was sticking out into the lane, so the wreck set off a chain reaction involving seven vehicles. One person was killed. KCPS will remain on provisional accreditation. The school released its full 2019 academic performance report from the state of Missouri today. Officials at the school say students scored higher in English and science than last year. They also exceeded state expectations in math. A major hit against the school though, attendance. District leaders say they're working to improve and achieve full accreditation next year. Today, the University of Missouri announced Elia Drinkwich as its football coach. The school officials introduced him today. Drinkwich takes over for Barry Odom, who was fired at the end of the season. Drinkwich comes to MU after winning a Sun Belt title and going 12-1 and with Appalachian State. Gary has the forecast for you now. Thank you very much. And Dia, here's what's going on. We do have a storm that will be developing this weekend. The question is exactly when will it get to Kansas City? This is snow and cold for the Chiefs Denver game. Something we're monitoring still a little bit too far off. Seven day forecast 52 Thursday, 54 Friday, 34 Saturday and 33 with a 30% chance of that snow or freezing rain or sleet Sunday. Oh boy. Uh, we'll be monitoring that closely, and remember to get your news and weather anytime at KSHB.com. Cutting the cable cord? 41 Action News is now on Roku. Search KSHB, add our channel, and you're set. All of our newscasts stream live. No other station in Kansas City can say that. Get clear, complete coverage on 41 Action News now on Roku.